Hello everyone, I am Torior, and today we're going to talk about Mass Effect Andromeda, the mysterious benefactor, and why I believe it's Dr. Lexi Tapiro. Quite obviously, this video will contain spoilers for Mass Effect Andromeda. Let's get on with it. Who is the benefactor? The benefactor is a person or a group of people uh, that secretly backed the Andromeda Initiative, funded it as a silent partner to Gian Garson. We learn about the existence of the benefactor from Alec Ryder's memories stored within Sam. The benefactor is a shady figure at best, responsible, among other things, for the murder of Gian Garson. The benefactor's face or faces are never shown and the voice used in communication with Alec Ryder is distorted. However, several clues can be found in the game itself, not many, but with their help and making a few assumptions, I arrived at the conclusion that it's actually Lexi, our ship's doctor. I'm going to take you through my reasoning process. There is going to be a lot of assumptions on my part, but bear with me. First off, we have a clue from uh, the game's creators regarding the identity of the benefactor, Michael Gamble, Andromeda's producer, said this in an interview with Forbes. The mysterious benefactor is intentionally left unresolved, as it has a deeper ties to the meta-story of the Mass Effect Andromeda saga. By the time you find the killer, they are long gone. This little piece of information suggests two things to us. First, probably, though not necessarily, uh, the benefactor could be a single person, because by the time you find the killer, they are long gone. It also makes me think, of course I might be wrong, that the benefactor is a person we actually meet in-game in Mass Effect Andromeda. Of course it could be someone completely different, a character that has not appeared yet, however from the story perspective it would be much much better, it would have much more impact if the benefactor was actually a character we already know. So the benefactor is someone who came from the Milky Way galaxy, and most probably someone we met in-game. It would very probably also be a memorable person. Just from the game maker's perspective, it is much better if a player playing, let's say, Mass Effect Andromeda 2 or 3 discovers the identity of the benefactor and then thinks, oh yeah, I remember that character from the first game. This is all, of course, an assumption on my part. However, I know a thing or two about building a story and this is exactly how I would have done it. So, so far we have a character from the Milky Way galaxy, someone we meet in-game. The benefactor is also a very rich and powerful individual or group, something akin to Elusive Man or the Shadow Broker. Lexi is not the only person that fits this profile, but she indeed does fit. She is an older Asari, over 200 years old. Well, 200 years is not older for an Asari, but she certainly has lived long enough to amass enough power and wealth. Moreover, we know very little about her past. She is a very secretive person, so she fits the bill so far, but we don't have enough evidence to, you know, be sure that it's her. But that's not everything. Now let's go out of the game's universe and back to our own. Lexi is voiced by Natalie Dormer. Natalie Dormer is most known for her role as Marjorie Tyrell in Game of Thrones. She is a very beautiful woman with a remarkable voice, and many fans would love to romance a character voiced by her. However, Lexi is not a romanceable character. In a game where you can romance almost everyone you meet who isn't a background character, I would think that a character voiced by someone so beloved by so many fans would certainly be an option, unless there is a good reason for her to not be an option. Like, for example, her being the benefactor. Also, as far as I know, Lexi is the only character with whom you can discuss your memories that you pull from Sam, or actually your father's memories. You can actually talk to her about wondering who the benefactor is, and wouldn't it be pretty cool if it turned out to be her? Even though she warms up to the main character and the crew later on, Lexi is visibly trying to keep her distance. Her being on the Tempest and acting like that would be consistent with her being the grey eminence that pulls all the strings, while also remaining close to the action, but relatively safe. She's also quite obviously dodging questions and hiding something, which you can observe at many occasions. For example, when you meet her at the bar. She offers an explanation for her behavior, but it's one that at least I thought to be a misdirection, something trying to divert our attention from the real issue and keep us from digging further. Of course, again, I might be wrong. I hope by now you will agree that she fits the bill perfectly, and she could be the benefactor, but these are all assumptions, all evidence, well, not really evidence, based on the fact that she could be the benefactor. 
Now for my crowning argument, the voice. The voice of the benefactor in Alec Ryder's memories is distorted. However, you can recognize the voice as female, but if you listen more closely, if you really get into it, you can hear the little mannerisms in certain syllables, the tone, the rhythm. Even if the actor is speaking in a different voice, you can often recognize them. And in this case, I am 90% sure this is Natalie Dolmer. If there is a war, the scramble for resources will be on a scale we've never seen before. Natalie Dolmer, who voices Dr. Alexi Tapiro. Listen and compare. I can break bones just as well as I can mend them, Pathfinder. The chaos will be monumental. We can't get caught in the crossfire. Is there something else? We'll need a new home. Now, if I'm wrong in this final argument, my whole theory, my whole hypothesis falls apart. Of course, I realize that. But am I wrong? I guess we'll see in the next game. But I bet Lexi Tipiro is the mysterious benefactor. Or one of them, if they're a group. Thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed it. And make sure to check my other theory and lore videos. Goodbye.